And now a petition is going around asking Governor Roy Cooper to let hair salons reopen. Stylists are asking for a little bit of leniency to open days before his executive order expires. WFMY News 2's Adoria Chumba spoke to the woman who started that petition. It's a petition on moveon.org being replicated in different states. The North Carolina version wants hair salons to have a soft opening on April 27th, just two days before Governor Roy Cooper's executive order expires. We thrive and run on local businesses. And when those people who are trying to run businesses, they can't do it, it not only messes with the livelihood of their household, but of the whole city. Keisha Lindsay runs the beauty shop in King, which, like many across the state, is closed because of coronavirus. As a hairdresser, sanitation practices, like we do that every time, um, all the time. You don't use the same cake twice without it being laundered first. You don't use the same comb on John that you're about to use on Betty. That's why she wants hair salons and barber shops to be allowed to open and take in one client at a time. When you go to Walmart, and there's people back to back, that's way more dangerous than coming and sitting in my chair. If they tell me that I can open tomorrow, tomorrow I'm in the shop and I'm starting at 3, 4 o'clock in the morning if somebody's ready to come. Rakesha <laughs> Melton also signed the petition. She's ready to get back to work, but she's also cautious. It's kind of hard to determine, you know, is it the right thing for us to go ahead and open or should we, we wait? It's scary because you don't know if today is the day I'm going to come in contact with someone and they are sick. This petition now has nearly 4,500 signatures, while another on Facebook to reopen the state has nearly 39,000 signatures. While the executive order expires at 5 p.m. on April 29th, Governor Roy Cooper hasn't said yet if businesses will reopen.